In the previous video, we have learned about factors and multiples. In today's video, we will be discussing about HCF and different methods of finding HCF in detail. By definition, the HCF of two or more numbers is the highest number among all the common factors of the given numbers. HCF stands for highest common factor, also known as GCF, greatest common factor, or GCD, greatest common divisor. Let's find out the HCF of 15 and 80. The factors of 15 are 1, 3, 5 and 50. And the factors of 18 are 1, 2, 3, 6, 9 and 80. We clearly see 1 and 3 are the only common factors. But the factor 3 is the highest or greatest of the common factors. And therefore, the HCF of 15 and 18 is 3. Now, because we know what is HCF, let's understand different methods of finding HCF. There are three different methods of finding the HCF of two or more numbers. The methods are namely common factor method, prime factorization method and division method. Let us first understand how to find the HCF of two or more numbers by using common factor method. The steps are as follows. First, list out all the factors of two or more numbers separately. Second, compare them. Next, write the factors that are common to both the given numbers. And last, the highest common factor will be the HCF of two or more numbers. Let us understand this with the help of an example. Let's find out the HCF of 15 and 21. First, we will list out the factors of 15 and 21 separately. The factors of 15 are 1, 3, 5 and 15. And the factors of 21 are 1, 3, 7 and 21. Now, the common factors between 15 and 21 are 1 and 3. But clearly, 3 is the greatest common factor. And therefore, the HCF of 15 and 21 is 3. Now, the second method for finding the HCF of two or more numbers is by using prime factorization method. The steps are as follows. First, write each number as a product of its prime factors. To obtain the HCF, multiply all the prime factors that are common to both the given numbers. And lastly, the product of all the common prime factors is the HCF. Now, consider the number 12 and 20. So, let's find out the HCF of 12 and 20. The prime factors of 12 can be written as 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 3. We do the same with 20. Actually, why don't you try writing the prime factors of 20? Pause the video and give it a shot. So, the prime factors of 20 can be written as 2 multiplied by 2 multiplied by 5. Now, to find the HCF, all we need to do is multiply the prime factors that are common to both the numbers. 2 is a common prime factor for both the numbers. So, we write down 2 once. There is another 2 that is common. So, writing 2 again and therefore the HCF of 12 and 20 is 2 multiplied by 2 which is 4. Last but not the least, division method. 
the steps for finding the HCF of two or more numbers using division method is as follows. First, divide the largest number by the smallest number. Second, take the divisor as new dividend and remainder as the new divisor. And last, proceed till the remainder is zero and the last divisor will be the HCF of the given numbers. Let's consider the numbers 15 and 24. We need to divide the largest number by the smallest number. Here, 24 is the larger number and 15 is the smaller number. So we divide 24 by 15. When we divide 24 by 15, the quotient is 1 and the remainder equals 9. Also, 15 is the divisor and 24 is the dividend here. Now, take divisor as new dividend and remainder as new divisor. That is, divide the first divisor by the first remainder. So, dividing 15 by 9. When we divide 15 by 9, the quotient equals 1 and the remainder is 6. We are not done yet because the remainder is still not 0. So proceed further till the remainder is 0. And the last divisor will be the HCF of given numbers. So again, divide 9 by 6. So the quotient equals 1 and the remainder equals 3. Again, dividing 6 by 3. So when we divide 6 by 3, the quotient equals 2 and the remainder equals 0. Because the remainder is 0, we stop here. And therefore, the HCF of 15 and 24 is the last divisor, which is 3. In the next video, we will be discussing about LCM and different methods of finding LCM in detail. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.